Hello, ladies and gentlemen, and welcome to Game Night, the only game show that's exclusively on PMC, PMCWatch.com, and Channel 5. Now, I am back with the most wonderful Jamie. Is that what we're calling Jamie, you still? The Portland extrovert. The Portland extrovert. And Jamie, who did you bring with you today? I brought Brian, the right. Portland introvert extrovert. So, so this is the classic extrovert dragging the introvert along to other ah, parties. Right. See, I go on social media. I know these things. That's right. I'm very hip. He may have figured that one out. Yes. But he's pretty smart and pretty cool at being extroverted when needed. Is that what you would say? Um, she's trying. She's trying. All right. And then to my other side, I have two new people who are just joining Gay Right for the first time. Please introduce yourselves. We'll start with you. Uh, my name is Bobby. Um, I, I don't have a catchy catchphrase to no, kind of go along with that. No so. catchphrase with that? All right. Well, we won't hold it against him. Let's move on. My name is Liz. I don't know that camera. All right. My name is Liz. I have a podcast. My pronouns are they, them. All right, Liz, thank you, Liz, Bobby, for coming on Game Night. So today, guys, for, you know, Jamie, you've already played Game Night. You understand how this goes. But for those who have not played Game Night, let me just tell you what it's all about. So we're going to start right now with our ABC segment. That means I'm going to ask a question, and the answer to that question is going to be the le that letter of the alphabet. So I'll ask a question starting with A, and that answer will, will begin with the letter a. That's right. And then Better we're going to go a. down the list, the full alphabet. Then we go on to our two speed rounds. And then at the final, we have final Jeopardy. All right? Perfect. All right. So are we ready to play? Woo! Woo! Are we ready? I'm so ready. And I would like to say that tonight's theme is movie. So movie. all these questions that I will be asking are related to movies. Yeah. We've all seen movies, right? Have you seen a movie before? I've, I've seen one or two You've here. Se have you seen a movie? I haven't moved on to talkies just yet, but I'm getting there. Okay. She, the, the, she, the, and what about you guys? Maybe a couple. Uh, couple more movies? of the Portland extrovert, so I watch people as my movies. You watch pe you, you, you go around watching people going, oh, yeah. Yeah, I that. see you. The world is a you. movie to you. Yeah. You're like the main character in your movie. Ooh. Thank Am I you. right? Thank you. I'll oh, take that. Okay. Portland extrovert. <laughs> All right. Character. So, guys, let's begin first with our ABC segment. So, let's begin. Are we guys ready? Are we ready? ready? We're ready. I'm so ready. All right, let's begin with letter A. This breakout role made Kevin Spacey a star and won him an Oscar in 1998. Uh, American Beauty? That is correct. Whoa! Look at this. Oh, Wait, let you finish the question. Quick. No, yeah. No, no, well, yeah, finish the question. But no, you were right to answer okay. when you did. Guys, what what's like a name I can call you? I'm calling them the Portland Extroverts. What Portland Extroverts folks? with Jamie um, Terrellin. Over here on the right. Over here on the right. So <laughs> over here on the right is currently winning by one point. Once again, ABC's one point each. Guys, you got to pick it up. Come on. All that's, right. uh, that's, that's not a political statement or anything. <laughs> that's not a political no, statement, no. Letter, over there. Like, letter A, Michael J. Fox ended up almost dating his mother, played by Lee Thomas, and this 1980s comedy uh, about time travel. I that's, said, let me finish oh, so the question, but you know. The, letter B, you said letter A. Yeah, you did say letter A. I said letter B. Okay, now we're saying letter B? We're saying letter B now. But this is your first time on game that I'm not going to hold it against you. What? That's the answer. Back to the Future. That ah! is correct. Ah, Come on, guys. You're you waiting to the end of the question. Well, remember, we got to wait till the okay, end of the okay. question <laughs> to then oh, answer. We're gonna, but apart we're from that, right now, we're the folks to my right rules. are currently winning. Smart. Look at that. All right, letter C. Oh, C. You know that letter C. I All see. right. This 1970s girl movie, uh, uh, adopted from a Stephen King book, shows a strange young girl with telekinesis powers wreak wreaking havoc on her high school prom. Carrie? That is correct. Ah! Come on. Ah! Man. All I could think uh, of was Cujo. I will say, Cujo. I haven't seen the movie. I did read the book, though, so I feel a little bad, because this is movie trivia. Well, I mean, they're the same. They're, I mean, I, I've never seen I Carrie, so I, I really couldn't talk to her. Are they movies. similar? Oh, well, you've, you've never seen I the book. I haven't seen the movie. So that's right. So, She's okay, we gotta move before. on now. Letter D. Okay, D. Ready, guys? Letter D. Bruce Willis knocked it out of the park in this giant 90s action film playing a retired cop John McClane. What is? Die Hard. That is correct. Woo! That is the Woo! We're stepping it up. Ow, We're ow, stepping ow, it up. Ow. Coming after the people to my right. 
<laughs> uh, We're not dying yet. They're not dying yet. All right, moving on to letter E. The lead character in this Spielberg hit loved Reese's Pieces and always wished to phone home. What is? E.T. That is oh, correct. Oh, no! All right, look at that. All right, moving right Where along to letter F. This Nicolas Cage and John Travolta, oh, Nicolas Cage and John Travolta fought it out, but also became each other in this thriller of swapping skin. Face off. That is correct. Oh. That is face off. Wow. You know, all producers before I knew the show. I last one. Uh, I'm uh, making sure you see our buzzer because I think we buzzed in first. All producer before the show was, was worried that you guys wouldn't be able to answer as many questions as you have. They thought you would sweep the floor with it. But look at that. I, I'm an extrovert. Look at I don't how these things are turned on their head. Maybe the producers are watching. They're thinking maybe we need these folks back for the next episode. All right, Ooh. moving right along to letter G. In this 80s supernatural hit comedy, Bill Murray and Dan Akron asked, who are you gonna call? Ghostbusters! That is correct! That, that kind of gave it away. That was an easy one. You gotta step it up, guys. Come oh, on. stop! Now we just got we're, one! We're beating you right now. I think we're beating them because we just uh, got it. I don't know about that. All right, letter H. In this Arguing early 2000s comedy, Will Smith wasn't slapping, but instead playing a dating coach slash pickup artist for Kevin James. Hit. them first. Yeah. That is correct. Yeah. 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 We're stepping it up. Maybe I'm wrong about that. Maybe they are going to bring the fire tonight. All right, moving right along to letter I. In this great adventure sequel, it's not the holy grail that he's searching for, but it's equally full of snakes. In Indiana Jones. And? And the Temple of Doom. That's correct. Oh. You can't just say Indiana Jones. You know, you got to back it up with the actual I, I name of the movie. Come on. Sorry. Oh, Indiana I'm Jones has done all sorts of stuff. It's you said Holy Grail, and I immediately thought Monty Python. Oh, I wasn't aware of the movie they did with yeah, snakes, though, so. Well, I, yeah, exactly. Well, yeah. yeah. All right, guys, don't you ready? Don't be afraid. Get those hands out here. You ready? You. you ready? We're ready. We're ready. Okay. Well, I don't know. You're, you're talking about the Bill doing the buzzer because you guys are losing so hard against the folks to my right. I don't know so hard. I think we're coming back. All right. We well, tied now? Letter J. In this Tom Cruise romantic comedy, yeah. this actor plays a sports agent and has Cuba goofing, asking him to show me the money. Jerry Maguire! That is correct, Jerry Maguire! Woo! Oh, right. He was the dad on Lizzie Maguire, right? Yeah. Yep. Yeah. Uh, you gotta be catching up now. Moving right along. I think we're winning. Letter K. Are you winning or are they winning? I don't know. I'm not keep really keeping score. Letter K. After the new kid gets picked on for months, it takes a bonsai tree gardener and maintenance man to help him learn that wax on and wax on. Oh, I didn't finish I, the question. Well, we don't know. You gotta let me finish. Where Come you on, guys. You're finished. I have to finish with the question for them to be able to answer. He buzzed first. I, I heard him buzz and I panicked. I'm sorry. All right. It's his fault. Let me, let me, let me, let me finish the question and then let's buzz, all right? All right, I'm gonna begin where I left off. Uh, maintenance man, to help him learn to wax on and wax off is the key to figuring it out. Karate Kid. That's correct. It's actually key to fighting back, and I went over that and said figure it out. <laughs> all right, but I think, I think they're winning right now. You gotta step it up. No, no, that's not what that means. I wanna see this oh, light oh, that shows okay. that they were right, there. Okay. I, 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 I thought you were coming over and taking it away out. from them. Up. All right, letter L. This, this, uh, this, uh, uh, this girl played by Reese Witherspoon goes to law school and hijinks ensue. Legally blonde? That's correct. There you go. I couldn't remember what letter we were on. Oh, sorry, we were on L. Ah. Oh. Let me, let me let me better state that for our audience at home. N this next question is letter M. Okay. Letter M. Letter M. All right. This uh, song's from hit artist Otis Abba and are featured throughout this fun musical movie. Mama Mia, Mama Mia. That is correct. You're right. They hey, both Mama light Mia up. Too. That's what yeah, it is. So that's how you're confused. Sometimes no, you choose them. No. Like I'm able to. Fi I have magical powers. Okay. And I'm able to know who. Is buzzing first. Okay. It's, it's a trait about me. That's why I was hired to do this. It's just my magical powers that, that okay. I'm able to do it. All right, moving right along to letter N. Nicholas mm. Cage searches through every part of underground Washington, D.C. in this 2000s action adventure. Oh, I know what it is. 
National Treasure. Yes. That is correct. Uh, yeah. Look at them. I couldn't think of it. I don't know. know. It's you arguable, it but Come it's on. okay. Oh, no. It's no, okay. No, you got to step it up. I'm just, all right. Moving right, right along to Leto O. We hear that? Leto O. Oh, oh. All right. George Clooney and Brad Pitt team up to pull off the heist of a century in Vegas, baby. <laughs> Ocean's Eleven. That is correct. Ocean's Eleven. Come on, get step yeah. it up. Oh, get to step it up. Got right it. Here. We gotta get on. All right, that. moving right along. Let O P. This breakout hit for uh, for Julia Roberts was so unlikely for its time, but she won us over uh, in this updated Cinderella story. Pretty woman. That is correct. Walking down the street. That's pretty we, we, woman. We don't need. Uh, we don't. You know. Get back, on the, get back on the. Get behind the camera, okay? All right. All right. Let her cue. We're right along in this scary modern alien movie. Any sound will spoke certain death. A quiet. Isn't it a quiet place? That just is. Quiet place? It's quiet place. Okay. All right. Although I would have taken the quiet place. It, who knows what it's really called. Not me. Moving right along to Little O, oh, this worldwide hit about an underground fighter introduced us to characters like Apollo Creed, Adrian, and of course, Mr. Balboa. Rocky. Ah! That is correct. I button to. How did I beat you? I don't I think don't you I, did. I, I it it, it, it lights up <laughs> that he picks you guys. You guys are in that. We have, he has that earpiece on the side. That's <laughs> not. Usually I can hear the difference. We don't, the we sound. don't talk Those about the earpiece, okay? We don't talk about I think it. that's guy is blocking, blocking you, you from... I think that's what's it. So moving right along to Leto S. In this fun animated 1990s film, Mike Myers as this titl titular, titular character and Eddie Murphy as Donkey Ham It Up. Shrek. Shrek is correct. That one, it definitely was That them. was definitely them. Definitely I, them. I was way, I, I, you know what? I gave you guys the benefit of the doubt. I waited, I calculated, my brain went into a mathematical thing and said, who really buzzed it first? And I said, it was definitely them. Folks to the right, okay? Mm -hmm. All right, moving right along to letter T. And this Michael, jo Michael J. Fox 80s comedy, he has a secret that my cone's out during a full moon. I don't, that's a spelling mistake. Teen Wolf? That is correct. Yay! I still got it right. All right, moving right along to letter U. In this classic John Candy movie, we first see a very young Macaulay Culkin. Culkin? Culkin? Oh. Uncle Buck. That is correct. Wow. That is correct. Step up, John Candy. Although my producer just told me it's at you're pretty tied right now. It's well, you're pretty close. Okay. So you're still behind, but if you can step it up. Oh yeah, we okay. got rounds. Moving right along to letter V. In a rather small role for John Candy as a security guard at Willy Wonka, at, at Wally World, sorry, Chevy Chase takes his family across the country in a series of crazy American situations. I heard them first. Vacation. Ah, you gotta have the answer. It's I, that vacation one. I have it. National Lampoon's What's your answer? But it has to start with vacation. I'm gonna go to them. No, it has to start with vacation. National Lampoon's favorite vacation. It can't be, it has to start with vacation. They, they're wrong, That's but you are right. It, the name of it is vacation. Okay. <laughs> it's vacation? Really? It's vacation. I just, my producer has just told me that no one gets any point for that because you were unsure and they just- No, we said vacation yeah. Yeah. and then Okay. We thought it was the rest of the. My producers have just told me that we are giving you a we point. We said vacation. <laughs> <laughs> you get the point uh, for getting it right. But All I right. think it is uh, National gonna, Lampoon's we're gonna, vacation. We're gonna move right along. But it is vacation. And my script says vacation, so I'm going off yeah. my producers. Yeah. Letter W. We were confused. If you were lucky enough to get the golden ticket, you might have either this might have either have been the best or worst experience of your life. Willy Wonka and the Chocolate, and the Chocolate Factory. Factory. That is correct. Moving right along to letter X. Oh. These wild superheroes never fit the nice guy bill or either or, or, or of earlier ones. No wonder they're so as they're mutants. I completely botched that. I think it was them. Uh, X Men. That's correct. Moving right along to letter Y. All right, this follow-up to When Harry Met Sally had a third star, which was the hot new thing called AOL. You've Got Mail. That is correct. Oh. I never knew they made a movie called You've Got Mail. It's actually the, uh, 
I think they made it again. Like they did a remake with uh, Tom Hanks and Meg it's Ryan. A, it's a it's a remake. No, I think it wow. was called The Shop Around the Corner originally. I like you've got mail even better. Moving right along to letter Z, and our final question of the ABC segment before we go to our commercial break. In in this fun Ben Stiller comedy, he plays a dim model against equally dim Owen Wilson. Whoa, that was close. I think they did it first. Zoolander. That is correct. We are at the end of the ABC's producers. Who's winning right now? It's 16 to 10 right now. We're going to go to a commercial break. When we come back, we're going to start our part one of our speed rounds. Stay with us. January 28th, it's Saturday Night Vibes at the Portland Media Center. Don't miss Boston's Peter Liu. When I was eight, I actually ended up moving to Australia because, you know, my parents wanted to experience racism. <laughs> <laughs> I've been learning Spanish because, you know, I want racists to be confused when I speak. What kind of minority are you? Show anyone here speak Russian? That was the best joke, and you guys didn't even understand it. <laughs> Tickets $20 on Eventbrite or $25 at the door. Welcome back to Game Night. If you're just joining us, this is the only game show exclusively on PMC, PMCWatch.com, and Channel 5. To my left, I have the wonderful... Jamie Terrellin, Portland extrovert. Ryan Boucher. Introvert slash the extrovert? Introvert slash the introvert. Extrovert. Right. And then to the, my right, yeah, who do I have? Introverted extrovert. Bobby. And... Liz Lane, I have a podcast called Pot Lucky, a weed sommelier podcast. All right, check that out. But first, we're going to start part one of our speed rounds. Now, 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 my producers have informed me that you guys to my right are at 16 points, and you guys to my left are at 10 points, OK? Now, part two of our speed round, each of these questions is equal to five points each. So if you, this is the, really the time to step it up. And I'm also looking at you folks. This is the time to step it up, get in the game. Yeah. Come on. Yeah. All right. Can we interrupt uh, you in this one if it's the speed round? Uh, th these questions are really quickly. Fair enough. Now, this is it. I'm going to be asking questions, and you need to tell me if either J Lo or J Law were in these movies. All right. Who's J Law? I'm screwed. Yeah. Who's J Lo? Jennifer Lopez. Jennifer, Jennifer Lawrence. Lawrence. Jennifer, oh. Jennifer, Jennifer Lawrence, Lawrence and J Lo. Okay. We J Lo. All love J -Lo Jennifer Lopez. J Law. Jennifer Lawrence. Jennifer Lawrence. Okay. Okay. Are we ready? Yes. Oops, I'm blanked. Made in Manhattan. J Lo. See, see how this goes? It's quick like that. Okay. Okay. I don't know that question. Jennifer Lawrence no. is not. All right, ready. Yeah. All right, moving right along. Hunko Games. Ooh, that was, <laughs> I'm sorry. That was spicy. Who <laughs> was it? J Lo. All right. Moving. Oh, what are you doing? Get in front of them. Okay. I'm watching. What if the camera can't see I'm you? I'm on this side. You can see okay. me, camera. All right. All right. All right. Moving right along. All right. Ice Age. J Lo. Whoa, that was oh, quick. I am gonna on. go because they spat out an answer. That is correct. J Lo. Yes, that's correct. All right. Moving right along. Winter. Uh, Winter's Bone. 
Jayla. That is correct. <laughs> Moving right along. The boy, the uh, the boy next door. Jayla. Jay who? Jayla. No. Uh, <laughs> Jayla. That is correct. Yeah, that, that, works. Works. that was too that easy. That was too oh, easy. Oh, I like We're gonna give it to them because they're behind. So you know we gotta help them out. You know, we, sometimes we gotta help out those you know who are losing. Yeah, the, the, the needy. The, the needy. Exactly. All right. All right. Moving right along. Dory and I. J Law. That is correct. Yes. And Serena. Oh. J Lo. No. J Law. That is correct. Wow. And then Selena. J Lo. That is correct. All right, guys, we, we have just effort. completed yep. part one of the speed round. Great. Speed round part two is right Great. up next, right after this commercial break, so stay with us. Copy. Yeah. You love it. We love it. Oh, what's that smell? But how do you drink it? Who, me? You like it hot? Ah, oh, so hot. Cold? Burr. Maybe you like it black. You know I do. A little bit of cream? Oh, I think you got some of Well, we know one thing. However you drink your coffee, make it the best cup of coffee you can have. Yeah. At Claw Coffee, you'll get fresh bags straight from our roaster, right to your door. Guaranteed the freshest, most flavorful cup of coffee every day. Hello, ladies and gentlemen, and welcome back to Game Night, the only game show exclusively on PMC, PMCWatch.com, and Channel 5, if you're just joining me. I'm joined by my wonderful contestants once again. I'm your host, Warren Edgar. I forgot to do that in the beginning. Hopefully, we can do a little title code that tells you who I am. But right now, my producers have informed me that you folks over here are at 30 points. Ooh. And you folks over here are at 36 points. Now, that's combining all the points from the ABC section and from part one of our speed round. So right now, now, you folks are winning. Are we but on round two or three? We're doing pot. We're doing pot two. But pot two now, which is technically round three. Pot oh, two of the speed round, coat. meaning each question you answer is once again five points. So this is your time to shine. Shining. Okay? And I expect you to shine. That's right. Shine. You got to take off the coat. Taking we're getting the coat off right so now. you can get right. serious. Now and pot shine. three is Bacon or Freeman. So Kevin Bacon. And free, I forget the guy's, what's the guy's first name? Martin Morgan Freeman. Friedman. Morgan Freeman. Morgan Freeman, Kevin Bacon, or Morgan Freeman. And so the questions are going to be just like how it was with J Lo and J Law. Who. What would Kevin Bacon do, it? or what would Morgan, Morgan Freeman, Freeman do? do? Freeman. Right. Are we ready? Morgan we gotta Freeman. We got to be quick with this. Kevin and Morgan. Ready, guys? Kevin we got to be quick with this. Kevin and Number Freeman. Number one Shawshank Redemption. Freeman. That is right. Come, you gotta be Brilliant. Quick with it. Remember, I said, do we are know we it? ready? Are we home? ready? No, but you guys obviously were not ready. ready. We'll be right along. Apollo 13. Bacon. That is correct. You gotta be faster with this. Come on. Bacon. All right. Black Mass. We both do. Black Mass. Freeman. No. Bacon. That is correct. Outbreak. What did you say? Outbreak. Kevin. No. Oh, uh, Morgan Freeman. That's yeah. correct. JFK. Morgan Freeman. No. I was say Kevin Bacon. Yeah, that Kevin is Bacon. correct. <laughs> Quicksilver. That's... Morgan Freeman? No. Bacon! Kevin Bacon. <laughs> All right, Footloose. Oh, shoot. My That's correct. Away. And Bruce Am Am I'm sorry. Mighty. I, I'm Bruce Almighty? Uh, Bruce Almighty. Uh, sorry. Freeman. That is correct. I had to go with them. I know, they, I know. Yeah. Although That's that was obvious, I couldn't get there. <laughs> the Lego movie. Morgan Freeman. That's correct. And finally, my last question, Hollow Man. Bacon. That is correct. All right, guys, so when we come back, right after our commercial break, we are going to be in our final Jeopardy, where we ask them a single question, and they have a minute to come up with their answer. We'll be right back after these commercial breaks. Stay with us. Copy. Yeah. You love it. We love it. Oh, what's that smell? But how do you drink it? Who, me? You like it hot? Ah, oh, so hot. Cold? Burr. Maybe you like it black. Do. A little bit of cream. Oh, I think you got some of Well, we know one thing. What's However you drink your coffee, make it the best cup of coffee you can have. Yeah. At Claw Coffee, you'll get fresh bags straight from our roaster, right to your door. Guaranteed the freshest, most flavorful cup of coffee every day. 
January 28th, it's Saturday Night Vibes at the Portland Media Center. Don't miss Boston's Peter Liu. When I was eight, I actually ended up moving to Australia because, you know, my parents wanted to experience racism. <laughs> Spanish because you know I want racists to be confused when I speak. What kind of minority are you? Show sure, anyone here speak Russian? That was the best joke and you guys didn't even understand it. Tickets $20 on Eventbrite or $25 at the door. Hello and welcome back to Game Night, the only game show on PMC, PMC Watch.com and Channel 5. That's getting pretty old to say, but yeah. I'm gonna keep saying it. All right, so I've got my two teams here. We're, fine, we're down to the final question of the evening. So what's gonna happen right now? Because this is Final Jeopardy, both of you are going to wager some points. Now how this is gonna work, you can either wager all of your points, none of your points, or a portion of your points. Now both of you know how many points you guys have. How many is that again? 71. And you guys? 45. 45. So, what's gonna happen is, now don't tell each other how many points you're wagering. Write it down, write down, we write it down wager. right now. Write down as many points as you're willing to wager. And it has to come from that total of points that you guys have. So come up to that point, and then I'll give you the question. Right. No cheating, no, cha you know, no changing the, the, the point totals just because you don't like the question. Okay, no cheating here. All right, good. we gotta speed it up now. All right, all right, all right. You ready for the question? Mm -hmm. And you both have one minute to answer. And my producers are gonna tell me when that one minute is up. When that one minute is up, pencils down. Or markers down in this case. You ready? So ready. Name as many Robert De Niro films as you can in one this. minute. What? Robert De Niro? The Robert Are De Niro films. One minute, one minute, on the clock, going now. Producers, tell me when one minute is up. Name as many as you can. If you get one wrong, it's not gonna happen. Oh it's the most correct films wins the points. So if you get one wrong, all of your all Which, of your points get? No, as you know, if, if they get a bunch of wrong and you get a bunch of wrong, it just doesn't count. Oh. Yeah. Which old fart are we talking about again? Robert De Niro films. As many as he can. Mm. So who, who are the prizes again? Okay. Oh, my mom would give me so much fun. Do you, do you know any? I don't even know who that is. Come on, guys. Robert, Robert De Niro? 30 seconds on the clock, guys. Come on, He's speed it up now. Like, oh, my God. What? 30 seconds, name as many as you can. 10 seconds, guys. No, no, it's, done. it's coming down to it. Put as many as you can down right now. Make up some of your hat. I mean, come on, people. And time. Mentals down, Mokers down. Eh, eh, eh. Mentals, mentals down. All right, all right. I'm gonna start with the team to my right. You should. How many points did you gamble? Three. Three points? You, I mean, you, I don't know. Uh, yeah, three. Yeah. Just three? <laughs> this is reality TV right there when you're gambling three points. All right, na name me some Robert De Niro films. The Irishman. Okay. That's uh, Goodfellas. Goodfellas. Okay. Meet the Fockers. Okay. And The Kid. The Kid. So those are four films. Really? Can you guys name four, maybe even five, correct Robert De Niro films? Are you guys ready? Uh, first, how many points did you wager? We've got six down. What is it with these people and wagering nearly anything? <laughs> oh That's pretty God! Fun. We, we just were gonna do zero. There was potential number. zero, so we added a little bit How to make it How many Robert six. De Niro films? Scarface. Okay. Oh. Odd Couple. Okay. Jerry Maguire. Okay, so Oops. obviously you guys get your. Uh, how many points did you wager again? Three. Three points. So it makes them the winner. And guys, you can choose between a prize to see Al Ganico live on Saturday on in August, or tickets to Limitless Wrestling. Which one are you guys going to choose? Al Ganico's comedy special night, Do Saturday Night together? Vibes, January twenty eighth, or are you going to get tickets to Limitless Wrestling? Which one? Uh, I'll take the wrestling. You can take the wrestling. What about Do you? we have to go together? No. Can we can we each pick wrestling? Y yeah. Yeah, I'm picking wrestling. All right, two tickets to <laughs> Limitless <laughs> Wrestling. Guys, you can actually watch its high strung Limitless Wrestling at 12.30 to 1 in Yarmouth. Guys, you can actually watch Limitless Wrestling on PMCWatch.com or on PMC's YouTube channel. Check it out. All new episodes of Limitless available right now. But thank you guys so much for playing Game Night every Friday night. And guys, we'll see you next week. Thanks for playing.